place where their loved one was shot and killed nearly two years ago. As ABC Action News reporter Julie Salamone reports, the family is without answers and the person or people responsible have not been caught. Eduardo Crespin's family grieves every day. On Monday evening, they return to the same apartment complex where he was shot and killed nearly two years ago. They're running free while, you know, his whole family is still mourning his loss and still crying because he's not here. His family handed out flyers in the late Kathy apartments in Brandon, where the shooting happened in October of 2020. Crime Stoppers of Tampa Bay is still offering a reward up to $5,000 for information leading to an arrest. It's why we're here, you know, to try to see if somebody will come forward and, you know, if this was your brother, your son, your uncle, your cousin, you know, you would want somebody to come forward. The Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office says the case remains active. Deputies say Crespin was shot and killed as he sat in his Honda Civic. Witnesses say they heard gunshots and saw a group of men standing near a vehicle that pulled into the apartment complex shortly after Crespin. It's hard. It's um Every day, you know, just wondering, you know, who could have possibly done it, why they did it. Loved ones pray for justice because a piece of their family is missing forever. In Hillsborough County, Julie Salmon, ABC Action News.